back on the baby warlock for some rumble this time using the agrona pulse rifle the traveler's chosen mostly because there is no better close range option trust me i checked and the butler rockets i can't add a grenade mod to this helmet but i'm choosing not to yet i think i'm gonna go for empowering rift honestly with this little resilience i don't really want to deal with healing i don't need it i'm such a glass cannon anyway might as well go all into that idea I didn't see the map, I'm ready for anything. Okay, I have the best spawn possible. <sighs> okay. You saw me sigh, because I knew what was coming. Who am I burning? Oh, nice. Now I can break this? Alright. You gotta be unpredictable with the shotgun. Beelining only works at a certain stage. I'm ready to shoot the ceiling. Ah, uh, he aggressed. Smart on him. He did the right call. I should have shot the wall. Unintentional rhyme. Not gonna rhyme that again. Okay, anyhow, I'm gonna play uh, Stump with the Pulse. Since, you know, I can take advantage of being out of range. Most people feel comfortable with the hand cannon. And so they're gonna have a really bad time playing me out of range. I can be patient, I can wait. I know he has a shoddy. It was smart, actually too aggressive. I could have also backpedaled, but I felt like he would have just played cover and wasted my time and I would have got pinched. Rumble is about kill volume. Let's go for the power, set up at a long distance, just with the sight line on it. If I don't see red ticks, we're going in. Aiming at the ceiling. Smart jump. Primary out. I don't have time to reload the rocket. Someone's actually about to spawn up. So I'm going to try to reload it and I'll switch to the poles if necessary. Perfect. That's why I always say that's a predictable angle. Is he going to throw the rift? Can't waste time on him. I'm going to throw an empowering rift though. Just in case I need it. Okay, so he's inside. Let's go to house. Don't have to deal with that. He's gonna rotate into me. Excellent. As I'm jumping, I'm checking my back just to see if anybody's spawning up. I cannot escape that, so I have to fight it. He's above. Let's close this doorway with the solar nade. I can definitely fight this. Keep creating space. He clambered up. I get power because he clambered up. He needed to do a grass at that time. I pulled out the rocket preemptively because I expected a red ping to aggress me. Ah, uh, I can't be floating up like this just because somebody's gonna dump on me in a sec. Oh no! Can I catch him with the skate? Yes, I can. Same door, same predictable angle. No tag. I have time to reload. Nice. I would like it if I could have a book. Like, could you imagine just holding a book out and it shoots spells like out of your hand and shit? An and that's like the way the gun works and it's an exotic. It's a book. I don't know. Ready to track him falling down? That control jump is very hard to track. But predictable. Rockets again? Does, it, does nobody want power? Uh, I thought I would do it. Not quite. I see him. I'm going up high. Let's see who he chooses. He chose me. Is he going low or high? Alright, so I'm going low. 
he got the other person. Now it's my time to escape. I can set the empowering rift around the corner, chew him up. This is gonna have to go at my feet. Okay, so Hunter's baiting it. I'm not gonna stand in the rift. It's too close to a shotgun. Oh, uh, almost ran out of space. Ah, uh, sucks for me. I uh, needed to reload my sidearm, or I used all nine shots, one of the two. Yeah, it only has nine. Uh, let's see what I can do to stall this, or hide. Yeah, still stay as far away as I can. If he's hurt by somebody, might be able to fit. Did that guy just leave the game because the Nova Warp was chasing him? It's pretty funny if so. Now I get to peek out of this predictable angle. Crouch, I saw him escape. That's my cue to run to power. Ah, uh, let's see, do I have the speed for this? I do. Do, do I have, like, any other power to use? No, I'm seriously stuck on just a rocket. Ninety-four. Jump over this. Always expect the shotgun to be aping. I heard the shoulder charge, so that means he must be close to somebody. I kited him like a matador. Keep that sidearm reloaded. I learned from my mistake last time. I could get killed by a shotgun right here. Oh, or worse, a handheld supernova. Could be below. Is below. He's trying to blink up high. He missed his blink. Arc Strider behind me. Can I kite him into the other guy? Nope, he's gonna auto uh, lunge into me. Sometimes you try to make the super do the work for you. But it ends up giving you a good position to clean people up because they're more busy running away. So I'm not going to do anything to this guy until now that'll protect me to push in. Still going to respect the shotgun, respect that distance. I'm dead. Unless... Oh no, he's going for the other guy. Okay, so I'm good. I'm in the clear. Looks like the power is mine. Just crouch, grab it. And trick shot with the rocket. Ladder stall, nuke stall. There we go. A pretty clean game, not gonna lie. Just play the correct distance with your weapons and you'll do fine. Sometimes, aggress a shotgunner, because that's the last thing they expect. Especially if they know you don't have a shotgun. Like, if they hear the pulse, then hear the sidearm, little alarm bells are going on in their head, just like, he doesn't have a shotgun, rush him! And then uh, that's when they're like, wait, why is he on top of me? And then they're dead, and they're in the spawn screen. And then they have to think long and hard about that one. I don't know. Subtle mind game to work on. Play the game. This is a good one. I can't use it. Uh, it's, it's alright. It's a blast radius one. I think I have a better one. I think I have one with threat detector on my Titan. Anyhow, what damage did I do? Oh, tokens. We are switching to the Titan. And actually, for the rest of the uh, commentaries, I'm going to hop back to my main. So, I'm sure within a few days, I'll know the Twitter poll of what account, what character, what subclass you like to watch me play the most. So, I know what to use in the future. I'm thinking because I haven't touched my Hunter in a while. Uh, next episode will be on a Hunter. I actually finally got the Dynamo Frosty. So, I think that's tomorrow's episode. Where I'll just be playing quick play, using Frosties, having Arc Bolts frequently and trying to get some big multi-kills. Maybe a seventh column if I'm lucky, but we'll see. Uh, I'll see you guys in tomorrow's episode. I'm just gonna turn in these tokens.